When I was uh, in third grade, our house burned down, and I had this amazing experience of family and community that rather than, than kind of a tragic thing, it was really an affirming thing of, of the safety net that was there for me and my family. When you start working or doing some volunteer work with, with folks who are homeless, and you see similar type of, of things happen and that safety net not be there, um, it, there's just really a lot of empathy on, on, on my side. How do we kind of create that, that safety net that's not there? Street soccer has been about is, is, is making a statement that we're doing this and it, we think everyone should, should join us. Street soccer is more there than just playing soccer. Lawrence was, a, he was a, a rock. He's my rock, actually. I think when folks um, you know, are in a homeless situation, you've been rejected so many times for jobs or found you know, life challenging for whatever reason, uh, it's hard to take that first step. Sometimes it's hard to just fill out the application one more time when you just feel there's no hope there. Getting the job is easy. Keeping the job is a lot harder. But as a team, holding hands, doing it together, you support each other and you're that much more willing to put yourself out there. We've been able to take advantage of an amazing amount of goodwill and understanding of community that exists in America. I heard about the street soccer through an article in newspapers. What soccer is about is maybe what life's about at the end of the day. We specialize in not giving up, uh, so there's never a reason to despair.